Hi, I'm Matthew Fitzgerald at salesstylish.com, and today we're going to talk about how to download, install, and set up the X-Lite soft phone. The Sales Stylish solution gives people a lot of flexibility in that you can connect to the dialer with either a landline phone, a cell phone, or a soft phone. Soft phone is just short for software telephone, and instead of it being a physical phone, it is a piece of software that exists on your computer that gets used in conjunction with a headset that gets plugged into the computer so that you can talk to the folks. Now for the purpose of today's video, we are gonna assume that people have a headset. If you don't already have a headset, you will need to get one, and what we would recommend is what's called a USB headset. All right, now let's go take a look at downloading, installing, and setting up the XLite. All right, so easiest way to download is just to go to a Google search window like I am here, and you can type in XLite download. Xlite is spelled letter X, L-I-T-E. And then the first option that shows up here on the screen, the free Xlite soft phone download for Windows PC and Mac is the one we want. And just to confirm it is, you'll see beneath it written in green, it'll say that it is from counterpath.com. Counterpath is the company that makes Xlite. All right, so we will click on the link to go to their page. Now, when you get here, you don't need to worry about this where it says, wait, you can just skip this and you can scroll down a little ways and you will get to these two orange buttons here, download Xlite for Windows and download Xlite for Mac. Now for today, we're primarily gonna be covering the Windows installation and setup. Although the Mac uh, is very, very similar on the setup end, although the download and installation is slightly different, uh, but most Mac users, I think, would know how to install a program. So for, again, for today, we're gonna to be doing the Windows, so I'm gonna click on Download for Windows. Now, if you're using a program like Xlite, or rather, excuse me, a program like Google Chrome, like I am, you will see the Xlite download occurring in the lower left corner of the window. And we're just gonna wait until that download finishes, and once that download finishes, then we can go and double click on it, and that will uh, run the executable and begin the installation. All right, it has just completed. So now we can double click on it, and this will begin running the installer. Okay, the first thing that's going to up is this window is going to ask you, do you want to make changes to your device? And yes, you want to let this app make changes to your device. You're going to click yes. And then we come to the license agreement. So we're going to want to click the little checkbox for I accept, and then click the accept button. And this will actually begin the installation of the Xlite. And as I mentioned today, we're primarily going to be covering the Windows uh, installation and setup. Uh, but the Mac, once we get to actually setting it up and entering the settings into the Xlite, uh, the basic process is very similar. Now the time it takes for this installer to run, this will be dependent on your computer to some degree, uh, but it is a fairly small program, uh, so the installation is, is fairly quick. All right. And it looks like the Xlite is just about finished installing itself. So another moment or so, and this will be done. All right, there we go. So now we can just click on the Xlite icon, and that brings up the Xlite window here, which you'll notice is a fairly small window. Uh, it's comprised of a few controls and a number pad, and that's it. All right, so now that we've downloaded it and we've installed it, the next thing we need to do is set it up so that the Xlite can communicate with your sales dialer's account. In order for us to do this, we're gonna need to enter some settings into the Xlite so that it can properly identify the sales dialer account that you have. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we are going to go to your sales dialer's account, uh, specifically your agent account, and we're gonna go over and we're gonna open up the menu up here on the left-hand side. And we are gonna go down and click uh, where the picture of the small telephone is, where it says calling campaigns. 
and we're going to get down to the last sub option, soft phone settings. And then that takes us in here to this black screenshot window, uh, which in a moment, what you'll notice is this is almost an exact mimic of the settings page inside of the x -Lite itself. And what we're going to do is we're going to transfer some of the information on this page into the x -Lite, specifically these, this section in the middle here where it says user details. And there's five things. There's the user ID, the domain, the password, the display name, and the authorization name. Just these five things we need to transfer over into the x -Lite. We're not worried about what's going on up here, and we're not worried about what's going down here. Just these five things. So now we're going to go back to the x -Lite. And we're going to open up the x -Lite. And at the top, we're going to click where it says soft phone. And we're going to get down and click on account settings. All right, let's get this back up here. There we go. So now that we can see both of these panels at the same time, now my x -Lite, you'll notice, is already set up. But for discussion's sake, we're going to go in here to 711. And then the next thing we want is we want to enter the domain name. So I find that it can be very helpful to copy and paste this sometimes. Now, one thing you do want to just double check is you want to double check that there's no typographical errors. Um, uh, sometimes people make typographical errors in these sales stylers' names, so just quickly look through it, make sure it's spelt right. And then the next thing we have to enter here is the password. Now, you'll, you're not going to be able to read it, you're just going to see the dots, so you can just type in. In my case, it's 816. And then next we have the display name. And lastly, the authorization name. So that's it. So we've copied over the user ID, domain, password, display name, and authorization name. And that's all we need to copy over. So now we can go down here and we can click the OK button. And then that is it. The XLite soft phone is now downloaded, installed, and set up. So the other things we would want to take a look at, as I mentioned earlier, we would want to make sure that you um, have a headset. Uh, so sometimes people have an issue is they'll plug in their headset and for some reason they won't be able to hear anything or people won't be able to hear them. Uh, and that's simply just usually because for whatever reason, the x -Lite is just not seeing the headset. So want, you usually want to make sure that the headset is plugged into the computer uh, before you launch the x -Lite. And if it's still not seeing the headset, what you can do is you can come over here to the top of the x -Lite window and you can click on the word help. You can go down and click on the word troubleshooting. And you'll see this is broken down into four sections, one, two, three, and four. And over here on section number three, there's a little pull down menu. And then you can just go down from here and select your specific headset or speakers. And you can do the same thing over here. There's even a little test button. You can click this little play and it'll play some electronic music. And you can see if you hear that coming through your headset. If you do, you're good. Uh, you'll also see a green check mark under number two to let you know that your microphone is working. So uh, the only other things we would want to quickly talk about here with the x -Lite. Uh, one thing just to be, pay in mind too is when you're done working and you want to exit the x -Lite, you don't want to click on the X in the upper right corner. You might notice, I don't know if you're going to be able to read that, but when I put my mouse over the X, it just says minimize the system tray. So in order to exit the x -Lite, you're going to want to click on soft phone, and you're going to want to go down and click on the word exit. Now, the last thing is sometimes people ask, uh, well, after I get installed, how do I sign in? Well, just beneath that, where it says soft phone dial in number here, this is what we're going to dial into the x -Lite to make it work. So for this one, we're going to type in one, two, zero, six, six, four. I'm going to press the green call button. 
you're going to hear a female voice ask you to enter your password follow the pound sign and type it 816 pound and that's it now the x slide is connected um, let's just say you actually did want to go make calls your phone was connected then your next and final step would be to go to calling campaigns go to view campaigns and then press the start button over here for whatever campaign that you wanted to run. All right, so that covers for today, the downloading, installing, and setting up of the XLite soft phone. Uh, as I mentioned, Macs are a little different, but also similar at the same time. The installation of the, the soft phone would be slightly different. Uh, on Macs, you have to drag the icon over into the applications folder instead of running an executable. Uh, but the entering in of the user ID, domain, password, and authorization name are pretty much similar. So again, thank you for attending today's video. Have a great day.